Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for the Scorpion Sun, Moon, and Rising. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you so much for the support. Thank you for all the support guidance. Thank you so much. And um, I want to say to each and every person out there, you have been so wonderful. And I'm sending you pure love and life. I'm hoping that your wishes and dreams will come true. This week is the first week of August 2017. And the week begins with the energy of the balance and the energy, the zodiac energy of fire. And this is good. And for you guys, wonderful. You're bringing balance to your financial world and it's going to be good whatever the situation is you are bringing balance to your financial world but also you are having the six of pentacles a connection with your soul family so this is extremely good so whatsoever is happening is that this financial balance that you're bringing into your world then you are able to connect with your own families and this is going to be super 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 good damas and airs it's going to be ladies and gentlemen it's going to be good so you have the four of pentacles and also the six of cups so whatever it is is a situation that has to do with a karmatic situation with money money seems to be a karmatic situation your week what is going to happen is that a lot of worries and burden whatever is happening in your week you have a lot of worries you have the nine of swords and the ten of wands the worries and burden or whatever is going on for you scorpions you're you know whatever you did whatever is happening there is a lot of worries and burden in your your life and in this week so be aware of this okay the wheel of fortune is here on monday so why in the middle of well it's your old energy vibration for the week it's a uh, worries and burden you're having worries and you you're burdensome with things so you have to work with a lot of people there's a lot of energies there is um confucius but confucius bring good message of the nine of pentacles so that is good you have uh, the five of of, of style over conflict over money or you know and on thursday you have a, a situation the eight of swords you're not seeing something clearly um, um your intuition is it's as if you're being blocked the clarity wasn't there but now you're seeing something um, it's as if the universal angels are letting you see that something, you know, it's bringing, it's moving away. Uh, you know, it's as if you couldn't see, you couldn't connect with your spiritual side and they are, have come to heal that for you. On Friday, you have the energy of the Empress. Energy of the Empress is coming in. And whatever is happening, be aware. Um, try to understand that there's something that has been stolen from you. Um, the energy, yeah, something materialistic that has been stolen from you. Be aware of this, whatever is happening. On Saturday, you have the energy of um, uh, organization and the hermit together. Oh my God, this Saturday is going to be a day there is a situation with organization and the hermit. There's something spiritual. Saturday, be aware of what is happening because Saturday, something spiritual is happening. As we look at the King of Cups, your own energy vibration is here on Sunday. Oh my gosh. All right, people. I am not saying anything until you see this. I'm going to begin with your reading. On Monday, you have conflicts, whatever the conflicts are. You have conflicts with other people on Monday. Whatever this conflict is, it's a karmatic situation, but the Wheel of Fortune, bring it so that it can be ill. Okay, whatever the conflict is, the Wheel of Fortune, bring it so that it could be ill. Whatever is happening, there is a situation that is happening. And um, the conflicts are here on Monday. And this is the conflicts or uh, karmas that um karmatic situation that needs to clear on tuesday is a wonderful day for you because you have confucius 
and the nine of pentacles so judgment and the nine of pentacles so whatever is happening there's a judgment and the nine of pentacles so this is going to be extremely wonderful whatever this judgment is and this nine of pentacles it's going to be extremely wonderful your week is going to be a week of a lot of worries and burden worries and burden worries and burden about things whatever is going on it's going to be a week of worries and burden I have no idea what you guys have been doing on Thursday we have the eight of swords you weren't seeing certain things clearly and the energy of the eye princess is going to come in and clear that up for you so whatever that you weren't seeing clearly the energy of the eye princess is going to really come in and open that up for you and let you see and bring clarity in your world on Thursday on Friday you have the Empress which is wonderful um, whatever the situation is uh, the Empress is going to um, make sure um, you know that whatever that was stolen from you be returned whatever that was stolen from you is going to be returned they're not going to get away with it okay whatever is happening they're not getting away with it so whatever that was stolen is going to be returned on Saturday an organization is there and the energy of the hermit the organization the energy of the hermit there's a spiritual something spiritual that is happening there is a spiritual thing that is happening so whatever the situation is with organization the hermit this is going to be spiritual for a lot of people because it has an inner um, you need to connect to find the truth and for some people um, you're blocked people are blocking your spirituality so be aware of this because they're trying but you need to overpower them with your own energy vibration on Sunday you are here so Dam is in here I have not ever had this the king of pen uh, the king of cups which is yourself and the queen of cups Sunday is going to be a wonderful day for you guys whatever um, that was not clear is going to bring clarity so we have the king and the queen so you guys are here the masculine aspect and the feminine aspect Sunday is going to be a day where your intuition is going to be extremely high for you men and women this is a positive positive sign for you guys and what is so good is that with your reading the energy of the moon look at that is a six of cups so it's cosmic families it's cosmic it's the universe of families that is connecting with you and showing you the way and this is going to be good because you've realized that there is a burden burden and on Monday there is the conflicts and the conflicts are um, uh, from coming from karma karma and you need to clean them so whatever this conflicts with the organization that is going on you need to look within yourself and if you do that uh, um, the universe Confuji is going to bring you the nine of pentacles okay so whatever conflicts you have with others cosmic conflicts is caused a, a spiritual um, as conflicts that need to be clear up and what is going to bring you is confusing judgment with the nine of pentacles and this is going to be extremely good because um, new message over money is coming in to you as we look at the second half of the week what we have here we have here yourself the king and queens of cups so your own energy vibration the masculine aspect and the feminine aspect and you have the energy of the eye princess and the emperor uh, the empress the eye princess and the empress so this week for you guys is going to be a spiritual week and it is the month of the hermit so the hermit is coming in and with this whatever is happening with your materialistic things whatever that was stolen is going to be returned our organization they're going to look into it and see that injustice was placed and it's going to be returned to you whatever that was okay so let's see what energies conscious spirit wants to bring out for you scorpion no. come on spirit conscious spirit 
What is the energies for the scorpions? This is wonderful. Spirits awaken, and this is really the energy for this week. Spirit awaken. So we have I embrace my soul purpose and align all aspects of my life to its fullest. I embrace my soul purpose and align all aspects of my life to its fullest. I embrace my soul purpose and align all aspects of my life. And this is a wonderful message for you guys. As I go to the energy of the wisdom of the oracles, what messages would like to come out for the scorpions buy the book buy the book whatever it is go buy the book whatever it is in your life do the right thing people just go buy the book whatever it is whatever they say just go buy the book just don't it's good just go buy the book and it goes abide by the social rules so abide by the social rules community respecting cultures and family um, customs universal laws the universal laws work within the structure of divine laws and principle that provide frameworks for human experience and evaluation the law of abundance the law of prior the Lord of Karma and the Lord of Attraction, the Lord of Thought, the Lord of Compensation, and the Lord of Naturals are only a few that are known. So learn and go and find out the rest of the laws, and you are going to be okay, Damas and Aaron. I am saying to you, Namaste. Until next week, please like, share, and thumbs up these videos. And I'd like to see thank you another time for the support that you have been giving us. Thank you. Um, namaste. Have a nice week.